three, two, one. Welcome to Big Crip Fishing. We're on our way to Silver Bell Lake today. Do a little trout fishing or uh, whatever else gets on the line. Hopefully we get a hit. Uh, I filmed a video a couple days ago. I was out in the rain. And uh, I was there all night long. Didn't get my glasses didn't get a hit. We recorded a video anyway for you guys. And uh, yeah, that video got erased by accident while I was editing. I was up to like 3 in the morning editing that video. And uh, yeah, lost it all. So this is going to be a recap. Hopefully this time I get some hits. And uh, see you there. And uh, this is the pink duke, man. Yeah. This is a, another little $20 reel or pole. The reel is $20 too. I, it's a Placino reel. And I got that off of Amazon. I had the whole Placino detractable pole. I got hit by a big fish up out lakeside and it shattered my pole. Literally. So depressing. I just got it back. Just put a new rail on it. Okay, so we're gonna put some power bait. We got that Berkeley's uh, natural garlic scent with glitter, power bait rainbow. That's what we're gonna use on this. And uh, I got this nice little tool.
good. We are good. Yes, sir. drag a little loose not too loose but it'll have some give hey man i'm gonna tell you something about this reel it, it sounds like it's falling apart and some more stuff but man this this little hair rinky dink pole right here done got me some pretty good size fish i like this pole man it's my old trusty i always depend on this pole if i hit on this pole we might have a good night you know that's how i look at it I got a um, power bait on here still, and I haven't gotten anything on there. It's been really windy and cold. It is freezing. I was thinking about putting on a little rooster tail or something. See if I can get some hits that way. But it's a little cold, man. You know, it's a little cold. I got to keep my hands wrapped up. It's cold. such a beautiful day, man. The blue water is so windy. But the wind could just stop it. It's perfect right now. It'll still be cold, but it would be perfect. I would like that very much. gonna get us some worm and I'm putting the whole worm on here because uh, I'm trying to get the attention and the whole worm just moves so better on these little hooks Thank you. 
louder without looking crazy.
learning from nobody. I just thought about doing it. And I was like, hmm, I wonder. You know, and ever since I've been doing that, and sometimes I, I'll get a bite on that shit, sometimes I won't. Basically, I'm reeling it in, but at a very slow pace. You know, just to put it in a different spot without having to reel it all the way back in and then recast it. You know, it's kind of like I'm getting double the casting. You know, sometimes it pulls your bait off too, so. in the background in a dog park here there's always some drama going on at the dog park you know? then you got the humane society on the other side of the park where you can hear the dogs there too but uh yeah we probably got about 20 more minutes and we're out of here so I'll holler back either with a fish or without a fish for my outro. That's what we doing. We got him out here. So I decided to be strong and stay out here. The winds died down a little bit. I got a little fire that I'm trying to get together. It's a little difficult with the wind, but we're almost there. We got to burn it. But I'm going to tend to that. I got, now I got a piece of worm and some of the goat bait. Synthetic corn. I got some of this stuff on there with a piece of worm. And I got the rainbow garlic. I'm getting hit right now as we speak. Hopefully you guys can see me. Oh, he's a good size trout. Oh no, we got him right there on the lip. He was barely hooked, but he is actually hooked pretty good for it being on the lip. Oh yeah, that barely came out. Nice size trout. They're kind of thin this year. The little guy, but he is strong. He is strong. But we got one for the ringer. I was able to get one for you guys. I, I feel awesome. I feel so awesome right now. Finally got to get one in for you guys. Let's get him on the screen. ASAP. Let me get him on the fish grip real quick. See how I stayed in. Prevail, he's pretty though. Got a nice pink fin. Got that nice pink stripe polka dots all on the back. Beautiful, beautiful stock trout. Oh, and he has somebody else's hook stuck in his mouth. I don't know if you can see it. But he got another hook in there. Got more stuff. 
bake some trout the other night for New Year's. Uh, why not have some fresh meat? First dish of the new year, right here, man. I'm ecstatic. gonna get back at it and see if we can catch another one. I'm gonna fill this one up with baby fish. They are eating it. That's proof they're eating it. And of course, me being the smart guy that I am, I left my um I left my um headlamp oh I didn't leave it I couldn't find it so this is the only light I got tonight which is okay we'll get it done I got a fire going I'll show you that in a minute we got a fire going we got fish being caught you know you can't beat that so it's been about 20 maybe 30 minutes since I caught that fish and uh, I haven't got a bite it's cold you see I got a fire uh, I think I'm gonna call it quick appreciate you guys watching Please like, comment, subscribe, share. Uh, I appreciate everything. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And uh, to the next one, till we meet again. Big trip out.